despite multiple security measures here, including an alarm system, high-tech cameras, and special doors and windows, the thieves were undeterred. With more than a dozen swings of a sledgehammer, they broke through bulletproof glass and, after making entry, worked methodically and seemingly without worry. They were definitely taking their time. They actually even turned on the light. I mean, I would have to, like, check the videos again, but I wouldn't be surprised if they opened up a bag of chips to eat. That's how, that's how comfortable they were. Hanny Felestine Hura owns Gold Coast Market at Chicago and Clark and says around 3 a.m. in plain view of passing drivers, the thieves stole the store's cash register and thousands of dollars of high-end liquor. I mean, our most expensive bottle they took is a $6,000 bottle Ace of Spades. But the thieves weren't satisfied, hooking up a Jeep SUV to this ATM machine near the door, which was bolted to the ground. They tried but failed to pull it from the store. An hour and a half later, what appears to be the same offenders wearing the same clothing using the same Jeep SUV tried to pull off the security gate from this liquor store at 75th and Prairie. But like at the other location, the chain broke. The crime's part of a pattern targeting since May more than two dozen liquor and other stores. The crash and grabs captured on video, leaving a trail of destruction, anger and frustration. At Gold Coast Market, which is two blocks from a CPD outpost at the Chicago Red Line stop, a message for city leaders. If we're not going to be getting support from, from our local, you know, officials and provide safety, you know, this is, this is the part where the businesses start taking matters into their own hands. Video shows the thieves spent about eight minutes here at the store. Police arrived about 45 seconds after they drove away. On the near north side, Eric Hong, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.